anything about the help syndrome? The help syndrome? Yep. No. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Well, I recently heard of that because I have a good friend whose daughter um, had this and nearly passed away from it, and she had some very, very serious complications from it. And unfortunately, because of that, she will not be able to have children again. Hello, my name is Jason Maskey. My wife was Alicia Maskey. She just recently passed away a couple months ago due to uh, being diagnosed with preeclampsia and uh, fell into help syndrome after uh, giving birth to her son. She uh, passed away. Help syndrome is specific to pregnancy. It's an easily treatable condition under some circumstances and profoundly difficult to treat under other circumstances. Most people assume that going into pregnancy is a very safe, natural thing to do. And for most women, that is in fact 100% correct. Help syndrome is the extreme end of a disease process called preeclampsia. Preeclampsia consists of a uh, disease process in which the cells that line the blood vessels become leaky and start allowing fluid to leak out of them into the tissues. This results in swelling or edema. These cells lining the blood vessels quit secreting the chemical that tells blood vessels to relax. And so they go into spasm. These vessels in spasm interfere with the blood flow to various organs. The longer one stays pregnant with this condition and is undelivered, the sicker one is going to get. Does it scare you guys at all? Definitely. Yeah, it I really mean, does. It hit hard. Uh, just, I mean, we're at like the age where we want to start having family. You don't think nothing bad like Alicia had would, would happen. I guess it's just one of those things that you, you expect pregnancy is to be good. All women don't think about, you know, something could happen, especially preeclampsia, which nobody really knows about, nor the HELP syndrome. At 3.39 a.m. on September 18th, she passed away. My niece, who died in September from HELP, Alicia, started gaining weight, um, pretty significant amounts of weight, anywhere from 12 to 20 pounds a month starting in her last two to three months of her visit. Her blood pressures started out normal range. She developed something called DIC, which is the very last part of HELP syndrome, which means that her body is forming clots at almost every place it can, but as a side effect of that, she also is bleeding. She can bleed from any orifice, any needle stick. Um, she can be bleeding internally and no one would know it. They had to go to Seattle, which is an hour away from the hospital they were at, to get red blood cells. By the time she got her first unit, her blood pressure was in the 60s. Kidneys stop working when your systolic blood pressure is 70. So she was already past um, a lot of help. Her mag level at the end, which I'm going to lay that off to the fact that her kidneys weren't working as well as they should be, was 9.1. You lose reflexes at 8. You stop breathing at 10. She had already been coded, I think, seven times during the night before they finally had to say that was it. This baby was delivered sometime around 2.30 or 3 in the morning and Alicia died 12 hours later. We had to stay an extra seven days in the hospital because of the toxins that were leaking in um, Alicia's body. But he's healthy, he's big. We're back in Willisville with our family. Not knowing what the HELP syndrome was or preeclampsia, I thought it'd be good to also share Alicia's kind of story. If you have any family or you know anything with that kind of stuff, it's very serious. Life is uh, gives you precious things, uh, and life kind of goes on. It's hard to deal with losing a friend or a wife or 
a sibling, but just know that they're always in a better place. I guess that's how I think about it. And that Alicia left everybody with Hunter. And uh, we couldn't ask for a, a better baby. I've left my heart with Hunter, so be sure to hold him close. I know you will. Oh, you all think I left too soon. Just remember, I live my life to the most. I've left my heart with Hunter, and I've been walking hand in hand with Kitty. For watching our boys from heaven, the view from here is so pretty. I've left my heart with Hunter, and I got a hug today from Ryan. Jason, we both love you so much. Please, honey, stop crying. I've left my heart with Hunter. This was just my destiny. To my husband, son, friends, and family, love Alicia Schaefer Maskey.